I think the uh, the essence to really um, um, capture the quality of the, the photo book. I mean, if I talk about my own body of work, I think uh, it's very important to, in the first place, before I start the endeavor of creating a, a photo book, to know exactly what I would like to achieve and where I, you know where I want to end up. And then it's very important to find really good partners. So I always aim for uh, collaborating with the, the best publishing houses in the world and that have an amazing distribution uh, center. And then I also collaborated with graphic designers in a specific Irma Bohm, who I highly respect because of her creativity and the collaboration with Irma in this creative process is very important. And then the other part is of course the, uh, the printing process. I think um, if you talk, work with publishers like Hatcha Kans or Aperture that I've been collaborating with over the years, um, I think that is it's really uh, great to have this amazing presses and to really have you know the, the the possibility to print really well, to have the right paper, etc. And also, to, of course, lithography. And then the uh, last part I think is also really important: the distribution channels that publishers like Hachikans and Aperture can provide to me in order to get the work out in the world, as well as the uh, marketing uh, element of, you know, getting the book into the, uh, the widespread media. So these are all elements that are playing a key role. All, you know, they're all like small little pieces in the pie you create, you know, at the end. It's like making a really beautiful soup. I mean, you have to have really good ingredients. You have to know exactly how to cut, you know, the ingredients to put it together. And then you get an amazing soup that really tastes very well. And it's a very simple comparison, but that's basically what it, uh, what it boils down to. Yeah. Well, the, the, the beauty of making a book is that it's a, it's a, it's like a great journey. You go on a, on a journey to, um, to let's say, a country where you've never been and you're, you're saying, OK, we're going to climb this particular mountain and we've never, we've never been there. We go with a group of people and we don't know what we're going to encounter, but we, we kind of know that we have the capacity to climb that mountain because we're in a very good shape, etc. But the creative process, that's the beauty of making books that uh, I mean, to collaborate with somebody like Irma, who is, is an artist in her own right. I mean, it's an extraordinary uh, journey. And, and, you know, it's it's like that, that really makes it, you know, and also people like um, Leslie Martin from Aperture, uh, Marcus Hartmann, who are brilliant, you know, very bright people and who really have a, a very good input in, in how to create books. And I think that's the wonderful thing about making books, this uh, creative journey with people who are in the top of their career and really know what they're doing. It's a wonderful uh, process. I, uh, I teach uh, photography on different schools in the world and uh, I also see a lot of photography and because I've been in this profession for quite a long time I kind of very easily see what is quality and what is not quality. So I go through photo books really really quickly and uh, when they don't catch me or I don't think they're really have anything to contribute or really don't sparkle anything inside of me then I just close them and I go to the next so it doesn't really affect me that much so it's very rarely that I see a book that I think is uh, incredible uh, produced or very uh, brilliantly you know put together the older I get the more I know you know about what is really what I think is really good quality or not and so I'm getting more and more critical and uh, so it's it's far less there are very few books that really you know within a year maybe a couple of books that I really think are standing out